No, I said instead of drinking and little Debbie cakes, I decided to treat myself to some electronics. So you stopped drinking? No, I haven't stopped. I just didn't drown my sorrows when Greg left. Oh. oh. Hi, folks. I'm the contractor in charge. I happen to be working alone most of the time. Don't cut it off. What are we about to do? <laughs> We're about to install the last piece of outside structural T111 and finish the structure on the outside of the house. Yay, we are very thrilled with that. Now, what is the rest of this, uh, oh, miscellaneous and assigned tree lumber standing out here in my house? This is the Lost Treasure Trove of Antique Architectural Wonders. The Lost Treasure Trove of Antique Architectural Wonders. Yes, we have boards here that haven't been seen since the Neolithic period. Neolithic. And how did we acquire these? I met an old caveman in the back of his cave who'd been storing these for years with his nuts. Well, all men need to store a little bit of wood with their nuts, don't they? Most men don't have any timber in their nuts. Okay, back soon. Since so many people ask, where's Jen? Let us find out where Jen is, shall we? And we turn it. I am gorgeous, people. I am beautiful. Uh, See me? Hmm. Nice hair, sweat stains on the shirt. There's Jen. I'm behind the camera. And we turn it back around to you. So here is the last hole on the uh, T111 we are about to fill in. I didn't record. I know. I'm still learning. Got to be smarter than the equipment. Notice the Swiss chalet bump outs, which uh, the Swiss chalet package with dad designed, cut out, and built for my bump out. These are going to be a stake through his heart here shortly. And the windows. Let us not forget the beautiful windows dad has installed. And the air conditioner is ready to be inserted as soon as dad and I finish our fitness program to where we can lift a 300-pound air conditioner up a flight of stairs. <laughs>